brother. We got Liege. You can jump. There you go, yeah. Oh, it's Stormy. So it's Stormy in Hyrule. I will show you now. Which is what it was just like roughly round about an hour or so ago here. It was absolutely torrential downpour. Let's not get Charlie Gold again. <laughs> that style you put it. Right, so I'm gonna pause it now. Uh, <laughs> absolutely got my braid. Well, they go, oh no, I need to do this. Uh, and they're thinking, what do I need to press to pause it? <laughs> so, nope, too late. Struck down by Zeus. Um, so, I. Where did I get to upon here? Um, so, I've got a master sword. That was the plan yesterday. I've got a couple more memories. Which might be um, just a check. I know that's right in the middle. That's Death Mountain. This one I'm not certain of. I know it, it actually says sort of off. <laughs> All these pictures, right? Where it's got that little thing in the top uh, right corner of the picture that actually translates into where exactly that is same with that one so we've got that one we do see this at some point that's the one at Hyrule Castle so that's going to be an absolute bitch to do I'd need Revali's Gale before I attempt that one so I can just blast my way there then get the fuck out uh, done that one where is that Hmm. I'm pretty certain that's Death Mountain. Gerudo Oasis, no that, got that, got that. I think that's in like the high right in the pretty much centre of the map. But so but main thing uh Old Master Sword is sorted. Which is good to have. But first, we first let's eat something because we are absolutely knacked. What's Moff doing? Get away, Moff. Um, right, okay. Oh, that's put my attack up. What I wanted to do is get the two, get these shrines here and then the two towers. What is that? Oh, that's another shrine. So, ah, that'll be one of memories. Right here. Um, do this for memories. Uh, what was the other one? If I remember right, that memory that I've got to get from here. I think it might be here. Um, and then there's another one, which is a bridge going through an area. But I think that is actually around these bits. I think there is a hole. I think it might actually be around here. So. Um, tower one, tower two. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Fucking jeez. Wait a minute, what's sparking? What are we sparking here? Right, shouldn't be any of those. Thank you. Nope, not having that again. Absolutely not. Try now. Yes, oh God, 
Yeah, he's always angry. A hillion. We found one. I do want to see Sidon. Because he is genuinely the most optimistic character you'll yes. ever meet. So I'm just having a drink. Test of strength. Soft coffee. A minor test of strength. Oh, we are gonna mess this up. Oh, what to use? Might as well use this. Yeah. This is gonna be so easy compared. I've been doing like major and mo uh, modest. So a, a minor test is gonna be. Look at this weedy shite he's got on him. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, oh. Come on, spin it over here. Oh my god. Absolutely wipe the floor with him. I need to check something. Briefly. Right. Let's get out of here. Let's get arrows. Fuck, I need arrows. Hey, Tina. Hi, lollipop. Thank you. There seems to be no words being said. I wonder what that says or just above him in Hillian. Trying to get my head back in the game. Aurelius, I'm chewing up the fucking bar. And I got a smile upon you, goodbye. So stamina, a bit more stamina is definitely needed. More arrows is definitely needed, sell some gems is needed. I needed a load of wood as well, actually. I want to do the house. The the Hudson side quest. I do kind of want to do that. Yeah, what? Oh, Maya, how wonderful. You're a Hillian, yes? Perfect, it must be my lucky day. Oh, <laughs> I apologize for calling you out so suddenly. I am... Tofeo of the Zora. I've been searching for a Hillian just like you for a very long time. My home, Zora's domain, is in terrible danger. That's why Prince Sidon went sent me to in search of a strong Hillian warrior. Oh. Prince Sidon is waiting at Inugu Bridge. Would you please talk to the prince and perhaps save us all? He would be ever so grateful. I just like, yeah, I'll, I'll just save everyone. Right, I'm gonna go back here so I can. <laughs> he just goes, nope, and <laughs> just. Locks off into the ether. I have been downloaded <laughs> elsewhere. I'm 
just I'm just thinking that with the rain but with the rain is because of the weather and they're thinking go to Death Mountain get to that tower because it'll dry up there Maybe find a memory. Need to make some elixir as well. Find some five foot lizards or some noise. Probably needed way more stamina. Oh, no, he might. There is a totally different way to get there. We don't have to go through Zara domain for it. But another stroll through the woods. I don't know why, but that's just hilarious how they fly. You right there, bud? Bonk! <laughs> oh, well, well, the fire's out straight away. Ooh. Shoot him then, but we don't have any arrows. <laughs> now, if I remember right, let's have a look here. Nope. Right, let's whip up these bits here. I think that's where the memory is. I think so. Not certain. Possibly. Maybe. Don't know. Where's the tower? The tower's over there. Might be the best way to cross over there to be fair. I'm pretty certain all that water is hot as hell. I thought there'd be more updrafts here though, to be honest. You know, heat rising now, surely you should just skyrocket into the sky. Where's Hero Castle? Oh, 
this high road castle. It's there. <laughs> Let me have a look at that picture again. <coughs> oh, stubble. and a little basey thing by the look of it. Trying to remember. But memory is crap. So I'm definitely heading in the right direction, but I bet it's going to be under me. Usually is with this kind of crap. Oh, it's going to be in the middle of a lava pit. Middle of a lava pit. Can't be here. But there's one. Let's try and find this memory. Also, doesn't help having wood gear on me. So how much of this playthrough was just me jogging on the spot. Right. I should be able to see the castle. And the base, and I think that's the base. Lizard. That's it. That's the little spot. That's it though. That's definitely it. Maybe a little bit higher. I lady the flu for the last time. 
This is gross. There we go. Let it hold on. <laughs> so pretty that's it. Look at all the beautiful ladies in the chat. I'm surrounded by beautiful ladies. I'm going to really uh, try and prison break. Got Lee munching. She's got quite long there, Lee. You've already got no limbs. Back to the task at hand. Which is figuring out where the fuck that jump. <laughs> Lee's not munching. Lee's looking. Lee inhales food. It's the reason her teeth were bad and had to be removed because <laughs> she doesn't chew anything. She just inhales it this oh wait a minute ah, let's take a look at this picture i think that's it so do i need to be a bit higher up here a bit down there hmm Five females either. Females against four females. Two? What? Where'd you get a second male from? Oops. No, that was not right. That was too high. Here? It seems like I'd need a flap. This picture is. Right, I need to be where that bird is. I saw how to get this lining up right. So that's definitely that. Up there. I don't feel like I'm high enough. Some of our mag is on outside. This feels kind of right, but also not at all. It's definitely around here. 
It's gonna bug me. <laughs> oh, she has schnitz. Yeah, but schnitz isn't in the room. <laughs> or in the chat. <laughs> schnitz is chilling. Oh, it just saved then. Right, so that's that's lined up pretty right. Got that ridge to one side. Chill. Yep. Words out quite nicely. I don't remember, but I said it in the chat. any higher can't see no glowing oh, wait a minute am I actually a bit too low possibly this one's hard Top this. I need a cooking pot. More than all. Recall. Sorted. Oh, I haven't got this one on. This link is so bland. I hope they do more of it. The cut doesn't look too bad, actually. You're fine for now, but you know there's a fine line between courage and recklessness. He's killed two Lionels and a lot of cobblers. Bullshit. Are, that does not make you immortal. Um. It seems that not only is the frequency of these types of attacks on the rise, but the scale of beasts we are facing is intensifying as well. I fear that. I fear that this is an omen which portends the return of Calamity Ganon. And, if that's the case, I'm ready to expect the worst. We'll need to make preparations as soon as possible. There is no way that it took... Taking down one Lionel is a ball hick. <laughs> Shit, I'm fucking weak. First, I need a rock. Fucking turkey, get here. Wait, what? Why did a bird just disappear to? Oh, two rocks. Yep. 
Right, so, so the, so the tower is there. So, onwards to likely incineration. What is on fire, aside from just me? Uh. Oh yeah. I need to make some fireproof elixir. It'll do the trick, sir. Yes, it will. Oh, could watch Sweeney Todd now. <laughs> See if we can re re uh, Monsieur Pirelli's miracle elixir, but do it for Link. Stop beeping. I know where it is. I can't go to it without dying. I why you keep trying to save corner. Let me stand on the back up. Ooh, luminous stones. Just the most dramatic. Didn't even twig. Oh, it's so much faster. Everything alright, sir? You say weird singing things. Sounds not really healthy. Oh, um, I was kind of randomly singing uh, Monsieur Pirelli's Miracle Elixir from the Sweetie Todd play. No. But about fireproof elixirs, which is what I need to go up here. Oh, where the fuck is the actual. Oh, there it is. <laughs> hey, where the fuck is the actual. Oh, no, never mind. I've spotted it. I see lights. Still not very healthy, but it's really told he's not a healthy person. True! But it does look dope. And I did, as soon as I watched that, I did want to have cutthroat, cutthroat razors. <laughs> Is in it? Depp? So yeah, I saw it. Is she in Depp or Bob Carter? Or Alan Rickman? God, actually, God, he had a right cast. Sasha Baron Cohen, who is ludicrously, like, like talented with the different characters he can play and the range of his voice, but no, Rickman. It's good old Rickman. One more tower to go. We need to pick which guardian to do first. 
you know what? I'll let I'll let you guys decide. <laughs> Bird, elephant, lizard, camel. Take your pick. Can sing was uh Chucky when I heard him in Lamez. Burb. Cool. I will do the burb. After I get the last tower. Oh, but that tower's gonna be a dick as well. <laughs> Burbs can fly, always good. Yeah, that, that power is probably one of the most useful ones. And it's basically, it's useful not just in combat, which is where you usually, ah, stable. And that's, oh, oh no, I've already marked it. Um, but to be honest, that kind of is the way I'm gonna have to go. And I could get me an horse. And yeah, woo. Guardian there, fuck no. <laughs> Let's not do that. And also, let's take into consideration I am running out of stamina. But in the movie scene, I met Rick with, uh, movie sense, I met Rick is so underrated as an actor. I mean, we know that Johnny Depp is going, oh no. Rickman gets a lot of praise, especially here in the UK, absolutely. <laughs> Everyone loves Rickman. Hi, bye. Let's get the shrine sorted. Those touches are cultural as I think sometimes. I don't know, it depends. I, th I think we just assume that everyone loves, you know, English speaking actors, and we don't think that. You know, not the world doesn't revolve around. English speaking or like you know like American like actors and culture it's just a lot a lot of us assume it fucking does there really are <laughs> she's gnawing at the plastic in the cage there's these like little bits that are stuck up and she's like I'm having these Use it for the shrine. More key! Right. Oh, cool. That's pretty metal. Hey, wait a minute. I did not know about that. Yep. I just try and catch it, doesn't it? Got that. I definitely wouldn't wait too late for that. He is not handsome, so we don't like him. It's the most you'll ever hear up here. Cultural barbarism. Absolutely, Jesus. Can I freeze it first, actually? 
then magnetize it. Keep tappy 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 tappy. I'm certain I've got to get that to smash it through. It seems like it's hitting it though. It's landing right next to me. Could try and catch it up there and then bring it down. I keep cocking up this timing. Yeah, fuck it. Oh, just perfectly legal shoulder. holding that one back. <laughs> I love him like really over top roles. Die Hard and Robin Hood. It was like the best thing about it. Oh, what did that get me? <laughs> Nothing. Right, let's use this to defend us. This looks like a gun gun through from one piece. Smash them all out of the way. We're in. Oh no, there's a thing there. Nope, can't be asked for it. I don't even know what I got from the other one. It's terrible. Snake was good too. Yeah. He's got this like a bad guy, but he's so lovable because he's got this such great comedic timing dogma dogma he's amazing he plays the voice of god the metatron he looks good in that as well this whole the whole ha all the angels have this whole it's like a suit with a hoodie on the jacket and then these awesome wings that look so good uh, ben affleck matt damon Sam Hayek, uh, um, Jay Z and Silent Bob. Good in perfume as well. Oh, I've not seen that one. But definitely recommend Dogma, that's hilarious. Like going so perfect is kind of creeper. Ooh, colony intrigued. Right, where's that stable? There it is. Right, not a 
having it. Why are these boxes so... Just like that. Right. Why are these? Cass, you glorious bastard. How are you again? How, how are you holding up? In case you were wondering about the song I performed at the stables, there are many theories about his origin, but according to my teacher, there's something about his uh, ancient hero to call to his horse companion. If you feel like hearing it, feel free to drop by. Anytime, time to get back to it. No, not right now. Oh. <clears throat> I do love Cass, but... Oh yeah, let's... Let's sort out some stuff. Hold... Um, hearty salmon. Uh, don't think I have any more hearty stuff. Go. Something with a boy who has a very good nose because of perfume maker and wants to catch the scent of beautiful girls. That is creepy. That is creepy. Um, so, I want some elixirs. So, uh, fireproof lizard. And. Let's see here. I don't need one for the cold because I've got all the cold gear, so that's fine. Well, most of, most of the cold gear. Horse! That's a fucking wizard. No, I want a Zunda. That's a cool ass name. So much of a dogma now, but yeah. on in. If you're stopping to pose a civil, you pull the head as you go and see. No, not really. Oh. Okay, better take care. It's really hot there, and the hot doesn't really do it justice. It's more like a burn the flesh from your bones, and then the bones <laughs> burn those too. Because that would be a completely different story. A five proof elixir that I'm selling just met some, so how about nay, as the horse does say. Here goes about the stalker and all. And the scent is at its best at the point that the girl dies. Oh. I know Alan Rickman does not play the boy, but one of the creepy parents of one of these girls. Oh, right. <laughs> right, I need to get up there. Oi! Enough for your shenanigans. Put my shield up. But you got beamed. Oh, no, blame my sister entirely for this. Let's go home for truffles. Oh, it's the truffles, girls. You are a pain in the ass. We're traveling all over to find high troubles. Yes, I know. Your sister's gonna get you fucking killed, love. Honestly, the fucking. 
stop following her around. <laughs> She's clearly insane. Right. Who's betting Yiga Clan? Oh, what's that word on the tip of my tongue? I just can't think of it. Bet it's Link. Starts with L, ends in K. Lick. Oh, that word. When you use your tongue to say something, right? Yeah, lick. Mm -hmm. Not the word I wanted, though. Oh, let's just fucking... Alright, the healing champion. Also heard somewhere. That's right, you. You're Link. Lay down your life. Wow, you was fucking useless. You see, you see him elsewhere, and it's always she's after hearty troubles, and she's always they're always getting attacked. tower and then we'll go ahead to the burb maybe try and get the burb properly done oh, yeah. but I remember that this place is crawling with guardians and other pretty strong ass enemies as well if I remember right aside from Hyrule Castle it's probably one of the more brutal areas Was there? No, it's probably the area I'm looking for for one of the memories. I think I need to unlock this map for it. Yep, guardian drones for decayed guardians. In just bad guys in general. It's the full package here. Oh, he, he fair play. He fucking beamed me then. Let's just get up the steps. Hope none of them shitbags spot me. It's kind of underwhelmed that fighting thing screamed, prepare to die. Yeah, the fucking. The big Giga boys, those are pretty tough. scary that is high it's very high oh wait a minute don't that mess up Piss off elsewhere. Oh 
wish I could have a, a better camera angle of this. to go away now though. Please piss off. Okay. I need it to fuck off elsewhere. as well. That's not fair. That's not fair at all. Do I? I do one. Fucking perfect. Is that all it give me? Oh, you swine! <laughs> That's fucking not fair. Any more eyeballs? That wall coverage from you know Zelda games and <laughs> are not supposed to be fair, right? Um, the other Zeldas were pretty fine. It's this one. Shit, is it actually a properly way? No, it's not. Can't get in that way. Get out and stay down, you bitch. Let's see if there's another eye somewhere. Right. I'm sure there's another.
Okay, there's a chest over there. Give me some goodies. Useful. What's that? I like how pots have next to nothing in them now. Definitely need to get rid of some more of this goop. The first game was, you know, how the first design, the first game design, in a way that playing it on your own would not finish it. You had to work together, to talk to your friends, and find all the secret stuff. That was the purpose of the game, playing together. If I remember correctly, it's still what they try to accomplish. So the game is not supposed to be beaten by playing on your own. That makes kind of sense. Oh, right, I've just done a full fucking loop, haven't I? Where's the other eye? Ooh, that bit. What's up, bitch? Oh my god, Eve fucked me up then. I think I might have cheated that a bit. I can't find the other eye, which I think gets rid of all this goop here. But, ain't gonna complain. And that's all the towers, and head to the burb. Cause don't you know, about the word, everybody knows the about the word. His attempt for the first creator of the game, he heard that kids would not play together anymore and would be stuck behind a console, so he made a game that was difficult enough that you had to talk and think about with your friends to find everything. I like hit away everything, the game frustrated me but the game frustrated me too much because of that. <laughs> now we're now there's a walkthrough for everything, so fuck it. <laughs> Are you on about the first Zelda game? Or just the first game in general? Facility, I saw an old interview with a guy, Diego Miyamoto. Yeah, he, he like lived in like a quite a foresty area, and he liked exploring through forests. So that's also where it kind of all built up from there. There we go. Now, is that? The shrine where Zelda has a memory. Oh, 
housing no one elsewhere. I think it is potentially that. Yeah, there's a little story bit which revolves around this area here, which I do kind of want to do. Where the fuck is this place? Right. You know what? Let's head in that direction then. Am I headed in the right direction? Absolutely. Like a fucking arrow. Also, do not want to fall in that whole foresty area there. He was a bit of a hermit, I think. Tiago my mother. I find I find it hilarious that no matter what, you know, like Clarks has always had this kind of shirt and jeans combo, like with Top Gear. My mother's always had a blazer with a t-shirt under it. Never been in any kind of formal gear. Just cut damn that boy don't give a shit. That guy that guy is will be super fucking rich. <laughs> yeah. I created Mario and Zelda. They went they go I swim in money. So we've got a Japanese visitor. But it's a t-shirt. All the rest of like the like I think the the guy who's now kind of taken over a bit with like um Zelda and uh Smash Brothers. I think they're kind of doing the same thing. They're going a bit more of this kind of little bit informal. What whereas a lot of other ones, like Sato, who is you know honoured in this game with a, this like little pond. Um Need to go up to there actually. Uh, he was always like full suited and booted. As were most of uh, Nintendo of America. Thank you. That's a stable there. Could get a horse. I mean, in formal, he's still wearing a blazer at least. Yeah, but he's... Like when he unveiled, I believe it was Twilight Princess, he came out with Sword and Shield. <laughs> Bit of a blazer, t-shirt, jeans. <laughs> what a legend. We can love my mother. Fang and bone. Oh, that's the monster shop. Where I can get dark link armor. Actually, while I'm on it, I'm going to have to do a quick... See if I can... I like him, but he's still a bit of a weirdo. Oh, yeah, you... To think up that kind of stuff, especially in such an early days of robot... Of, like, gaming. I'm going to say robotics for some reason. I have no idea why. I want to see if I can get Twilight Prince armor. Come on, give me some up. Fuck. Bitch. Yeah, for he for Japanese he is weak. Oh yeah, absolutely. They they're either like one end of the spectrum. They're never in the middle. It's either the really straight laced. It suits, you know, you know, very very meticulous. And then you get the ones who are batshit mental. Uh, like the guy. Oh, what games did he do? I've not I've not played him, but I've seen him loads. Um, near automata. He doesn't show his face, he wears this big ball mask head thing all the time. The fuck cloud was that? Uh, Hideo uh, Kojima as well. Lunatic. 
Fucking mental. It's still got a wild temperament. Why? Is there no way of like sorting of shit out? Shrine, off we go. Faffing around. I forget that I've got so many gems as well. <laughs> Can you buy a shit ton of arrows as well? I need to. Uh, no. Fuck. Oh, I remember this one. Is this the buddy? Put in one. Too hard. Are you not going to give me another? Sorted. There you go. I'm sure there's another one. There is. It's behind. It's behind the actual shrine itself. Huh? Another cop from One Piece as well. Just waiting for the, this fight that's getting between Luffy and Kaido. Cut into other fights going on in a second. No, I just want to watch that one. <laughs> Although the other two were really good as well, I ain't gonna lie. Oh, that was very close. Too soft. Oh, he's got it. All this for one poxy chest. Two of those bad boys now. <laughs> yep, give me shit. Go for a quick wee though. Right. Maybe me yours. <laughs> Still going in there. Oh, 
No, I can ride down there. Ball bag. Re refrain from being a ball bag. See, that one would be a ball late to get to that shrine on, unless you get Rivali's Gale. Then it would be a piece of piss. It's still 21 degrees here too, what I'm trying to do the sleep thing. The thing is, we had so much, we had like a torrential rain for all of like 10 minutes. And then it's gone back to stupidly hot again. Oh no, wait, what? Oh, it's here? Ah, I think this is one where you need to give it a, a part of a dragon and it opens up a shrine for you. Yes, I'm going to have to stop after this cutscene I will stop for a wee. Remember the tea? I'd say that is like slightly warm. When I said about a friend she went in a dress. I well, I'm not saying friends, someone I met at a con. This power that, that dress. Down over time. Grass is a and it was power on point. It looks exactly right. And so I've been told all my life. And yet I never heard them. The voices from the spirit realm. And mother said her own power would develop within me. I don't feel or feel anything. Father has told me time and time again. He always says, quit wasting your time playing at being a scholar. Curse him. We curse you, Dad. I've spent every day of my life dedicated to praying. Pleaded to the spirits tied to the ancient gods. And still the holy powers have driven death to my devotion. Please just tell me. What is it? What's wrong with me? She's so emo. <laughs> but again, all the other characters are really interesting. I think she's just so boring in this one. Skyward Sword Link. And he was fucking clueless after time. It was better. Right. So. Now I'm trying to remember where that is. I know exactly where that is. I know exactly where that is. Um. No, Oasis is just there, so. Which is the closest tower? Go for this one. That's not nice on Father's Day, <laughs> Miss Elsa. But uh, to be honest, it has been lovely today. We've been out and about through Grand Leeds, going on like water, uh, little water taxis, going canal rides, uh, a Lego festival. Um, what else did we fucking do? We had McDonald's and, and then a pizza for tea. We've been out like most of the day. Before we left, I put a big, like a massive block of ice in. Lilo's water bowl. <laughs> Just make sure she were alright. Uh, where's the oasis? Ah, there's the oasis. Actually, yeah, go to here. Why is this bit so fucking empty? Oh, they're good. What's that? Oh, it's my shadow. It's, it's genuinely been lovely. A mini road has been so bloody cute about everything. My 
I said I'm going to talk. I do this all the time. Say, oh, I'm just going to get to talk. I'm going to have a, like a little break in a minute. After, and I'll say specifically after something. No, just fucking don't do it. Kick you to the loo. <laughs> and also, a bursa. Legs. Right, let's, let's find this video and then uh, we'll go to the two. Good. Oh, this look is fresh. <laughs> Couldn't give a shit. I'm after a, a memory. Truck is round here. There we go. Kicks again. <laughs> Fine, stay there and piss yourself. This is a cool one. <laughs> their outfits are awesome. I love their design. They just straight up murdered a dude. <laughs> Back in a moment, let's just check blood. Oh, uh, it does have a warning. I will get insulin as well, <laughs> and I'll tell you after the break. <laughs> just keep thinking, what is it? What's your blood? When I first checked, just checked again, it's now 17, so it is proper spiky. Get all these used needles out. Actually, best keep my pen out as well, so in case it goes back with Mini Rona to school. It was a super thin pizza, really, as well. I didn't think it actually really killing us. Been off, <laughs> been off, but yeah, it's 
It's when you leave it for a prolonged time, it has spiked quickly. So I haven't been super high for all that long. I only got that warning like a couple of minutes before Keita said. Uh, new 14. No, I sense it. You don't sense your own, or you ignore your own. You ignore when your shoulders go low. Lady Jane. Giving me all that kind of sass. <laughs> Never mind, spider sense. We need to sort of do to go see Spider Man. I really need to see Spider Man. There's loads of stuff coming up on TikTok and I'm like, ah, no, don't show me. <laughs> yep. You want to see the Barbie film? Uh, you know, uh, is a human habit. You do that too. I do do that. I've been a, a lot more on top of it of late. If I am going high, I've been taking action a lot quicker than I used to. Uh, and I've been in range more. Actually, listen. What percentage of in range am I actually at the moment? Uh, time in range. 57% it will. That's 10% better than what it was. The Barbie film actually does look pretty funny. Uh, we need to look for bar. We here. Right, let's go when it shops. <laughs> What's that? Roasted bass. No, thank you. Hmm. Hey, Melon. Does no one, no one sell arrows? Hmm. What? Do you sell arrows? Yes, you do. Wait, you only have one arrow. You useless feck. Right, sorry. Uh, I'm gonna blast. What's this? That's one of the pictures in it. And I've got it, so that's fine. Uh, so let's actually get rid of that one. Um, it's here. So if I get this, what's your estimate A1C? It's usually about seven. Um, seven point two. Bit of, yeah, it's in that wooded bit there. The f One of the turrets has spotted me already. I'm pretty sure there's going to be guardians around here as well. So when I get my A1C, I don't go by the seven point whatever. It's, we usually go by the double digits one. So it's 55 is my estimated. And my last one was like 52. Which even I was pretty surprised it was that low. I expected it to be a lot higher than that. I'm certain it was 
where my guide is around here. Oh, it's because it's raining. Let's just get to the memory and not have him trigger. Oh shit, there's one there as well. Let's get this memory and what the fuck out of here. Because <laughs> I now get what A1C means. Had to Google that because English medical terms. So it's just basically what your blood sugar level is over a more prolonged period of time. It's how much glucose is bonded to your red blood cells. Because once they're bonded to them, then red blood cells are pretty much fucked. <laughs> so. by the sword that seals the darkness. You have shown unflinching bravery and skill in the face of darkness and adversity, and have proven yourself worthy of the blessings of the goddess Kylie. Whether skyward bound, adrift in time, or steeped in the glowing embers of twilight, the sacred blade is forever bound to the soul of the hero. We pray for your protection, and we hope that that the two of you will grow stronger together as one. Everything she wears looks amazing. Forward in the long distance fight. Gee, this is uplifting. It's making it sound like we already lost. Wasn't this your idea? You're the one who wanted to designate the appointed night with all the ceremonial pomp, grandeur, and nonsense we could muster. And if you ask me, the whole thing does seem to be overkill. I think I'm on the same page as the princess regarding this boy. Oh, give it a rest. That boy is a living reminder of her own failure. Well, at least that's how the princess sees him. God, her boss is so fucking ripped. We're not far off all the memories as well. Master Sword, check. Memories may be next. No, I need more stamina. I need Rivala's Gale and stamina. Right, also, let's get the fuck out of here because I don't want to die. Um, where? Rito Village. This it doesn't drop as much anymore, that's good. Already clear what's causing it though. That, that's the thing, we're trying to find out what's causing it with Kia, because obviously she's being a non-diabetic, she shouldn't be dropping more. And is. <laughs> so it's like. Yeah. I've got no insulin, she's got too much of it. <laughs> I practice again. Look what I can do just to spite me. Um, no, wait. I need to go find a uh, big owl boy. But first, I will look in his shop, see which one's got arrows. Not that one. Not that one. One arrows. Uh, this is all. Fuck all. Oh, this boy. Oh, this is Welcome to. Oh, oh. The object on your hip. Could it be. Forgive me. Where are my manners? I am Canelli, elder of Rito Village. Now then, 
There's not not the sheep is like dangling from your hip. Share his buddy. Oh my, so it is true. That means you must be a champion, like Master Ribali, one of the few able to bore Divine Beast Varm at all. Oh, what am I thinking? The champions will have been dead for a hundred years. This boy must be a mere descendant, an inheritor of the Shika State. Oh, forgive me. Champion descendant, if you would listen to all my requests, you would have my eternal gratitude. Thank you, truly. Now that I know you have the blood of the champion, there is something I must ask of you. How shall I put this? I would like you to deal with Divine Beast Varmedo, the giant beast circling above us. Only a chosen one, a champion, can stop a Divine Beast. You must enter the beast and bend it to your will. I tried to explain this to our more headstrong brutal warriors, but they wouldn't listen to reason. Teba and Half tried to confront Medor. It didn't go well, and Half was injured. Teba escaped unscathed, but I feel now plans to face Medor. As it ended up the champions, perhaps you can help us. Please find Teva. If you work together, you may be able to stop Divine Beast Varm at all. Um, I'm thinking reactive hyperglycemia would make sense as a drop in the night and two is after eating like clockwork now, I'm noticing. Yeah. We're starting to see the patterns, but it's also now pestering the doctors to actually sort some shit out. But. Peter's doctors suck ass. Oh, actually, if I go straight to him, um, yes, this is where I need to be. I might get arrows. I'm pretty certain he gives me a bow as well. All it would mean is eating five smaller meals instead of three, apparently. You eat about one and a half. Fucking. Fucking tell me, right? Here. Um, he is supposed to be here. Maybe if I rest a minute. Is that because I put a crick in it? Ah, oh, shit. Right, you know what? I'll do it as a stamina elixir. Fucking did nothing. Shit. Anyway. I need to speak to someone else first to trigger his. Fuck, I think I do. That's not annoying at all.
in the NHS are less so, sucky doctors. Yeah, but Well, hopefully she ends up moving here. So we'll get a doctor closer to here. And at the moment, the doctor she does have is very, very close by. So the, the convenience is there. But, like I say, they do suck ass. Right, you know what? I saw an injured bird. You! Hey, buddy. I guess you caught wind of that monster circling around her village. I suppose I should get you up to speed on what went down. Please do. Here it goes. You see this wood here on my way? I got shot by that thing in the sky. Divine beast found the door. Legend has it the monster was once the protector of this village. But those days are long gone. And soon as Tebba and I approached the thing, it just shot us out of nowhere. We tried to fight back, but it's, I was too slow and I got hit. Thankfully, Tabor caught me while I was falling from the sky. We had no choice but to retreat. When I think about what would have happened if Tabor had not been there, it still gives me the bumps. So you planning to find Tabor? I'll tell you everything I know. Tabor. Him and I go way back. As far as flying goes, he's undoubtedly the best in the village. His only downside is he's reckless and has a bit of a temper. He can be rude, but we look out for each other. But the way he was talking, saying that he was going to blow Meta out the sky. He wants to go back up there, alone, which is absolutely insane. What kind of moron with a wife and kid does that? Uh, no, oh, fine. Help Tabor for me. Right, maybe speak to wife. Uh, not big idiot, that's the problem. Um, in the village, your GP has to be within 10 kilometers of your home address, so we are stuck with suck if they suck. So, oh god, that sounds shit. Uh, but also, straight away, which is why I miss meals, and it sucks being if you sometimes. Skipping meals doesn't lose weight. But, um, never mind. <laughs> I'm not gonna. <laughs> I have the same problem and I prefer warm meals as well. Yeah, to be honest, I'm with that. I don't like sandwich, like cold sandwiches and shit like that. Nah, I'm not a fan. Uh, but when I had to do some testing, uh, splitting my meals was actually kind of doable. And when we say meals, not ice cream, not chocolate, not, you, know, you can have a bit of that, but not that as a meal. Um, forgive my intrusion, but I overheard you speak with the Elder. It sounds like you intend to help my husband, Teba, in the fight against Medor. But to tell you the truth, there's not much I can do for you right now beyond telling you where my husband went. Where'd he go? I know exactly where he went. My husband headed to a place called the Flight Range. <laughs> it's in a John up Pass. I know exactly where it is. <sighs> Stop calling me out. Nope. You do it plenty to me, love. I'm doing it to you. No, oh, real meals. Not the fancy stuff. <laughs> He's calling out every wound. As far as the little one I want. It's a place where Rita Warriors prepare for aerial combat. I imagine he's gone there to gather weapons and another run at Medor. As it happens, he made his way to the flight range on foot this time. If you take off from Rivali's landing, it's a straight shot then to the flight range. Ireland is a memorial for the Rito champion, Rivali. Surnamed in hopes that none might forget the events of that horrible day. Oh, we need a dish to trigger. That's why he went there. Also, my father was there, so shows it. No, no. He can say what he likes, yeah? It's like that. Ow, in my house. He's a chocolate addict and an ice addict. <laughs> ice cream addict. Thing is, I'm, I'm not a fan of either. Crisps, crisps, oh yes, crisps. Also, what's with Nintendo making really sacky fecking birds? They did it with Falco as well. Impressive, I know. Very few can achieve a mastery of the sky. 
Yet I have made an art of creating an updraft that allows me to soar. It's considered to be quite the masterpiece of aerial techniques, even among Naruto. With proper utilization of my superior skills, I see no reason why we couldn't easily dispense with Ganon. Now then, my ability to explore the firmament is certainly of note. But let's not, pardon me for being so blunt, let's not forget the fact that I am the most skilled archer of all Naruto. Yet despite these truths, it seems that I have been tapped to merely assist you. All because you happen to have that little darkness sealing sword on your back. I mean, it's just asinine. Unless you think you can prove me wrong, maybe we should just settle this one on one. But where? Oh, I know. How about up there? Oh, you must pardon me. I forgot you have no way of making it up to that divine beast on your own. He is a twat, <laughs> but I also kind of like him. I, in Lilac Wars, Falco was amazing. I freaking love Falco. <laughs> Chris girls is and a sports fan. I love my chocolate shopping ice cream. <laughs> we messed up. We did. <laughs> he is a bit of an ass, isn't he? Yeah. But like I say, they have these things with Nintendo. We want fuckable fish and sake birds. <laughs> uh, descendant, descendant, are you all right? My apologies. I fear I said far too much. If there's anything you do do not understand, please do not hesitate to ask. Salt that out. Fits him in the Japanese history. So I don't know massive amounts of Japanese history, even though we did watch a guy doing katana techniques in the Royal Armouries Museum today, <laughs> actually. Got to hold an actual katana, which was quite cool. Um, but is that a thing with Japanese history? So that's a fuck fish and get dunked on by birds? <laughs> Oh, now you're here. Where the fuck have you been, chum? Oh, <laughs> bless her. Still got a little kid again. She made it, didn't I? <laughs> Cute. Tebo, you told warrior. I don't know you. And I'm actually pretty busy here. I fucking you love his voice. Go. His voice is cool. I don't remember his voice being that cool. Yeah. Did you need something? I'm busy here. Hmm. Help me. With what exactly? Let me get this straight. Some random Hillian wants to help me bring down the Vice Beast Farmado. I ain't buying it. What's your name, stranger? Oh, you may actually have to start putting key rings on your keys, rather than adding more keys. The one that you got me, ages ago, one of them little key things, little, the sort of something, it came off its loop. I've, I've still got it, but I need to get it back on and like get it with some pliers. Link, huh? Well, Link, I'm Tebba, but you knew that, already knew that. I'm guessing the Elder asked you to come here and talk some sense to me, am I right? Sure is. Just let the other trust any fool wandering in that town. Look, you seem like an alright guy, but let's make one thing clear. I'm not going anywhere. As a Vita warrior, I can't rest until my people are safe. There's only one thing, or one way I'm going back to Vito village, and that is, once divine beast by Mado falls from the sky. If I have to kill Mado, so be it. 
All of them will have been sent to the village. Now let's get started. You serious? <laughs> well, far be, be for me to talk you off of that ledge. But as the other said, the only way to sell the divine beast by my door is to get inside it. Without a chance of that happening, there's no way we can set a foot in my door. Actually, so not only are you wingless, you're brainless too. Let me fill you in. The only people able to enter Divine Beast are five champions of old. And unfortunately for us, the rest of the Hyrule, they all died a hundred years ago. Oh, if it hadn't been forgotten. Now, man, let's focus on bringing down Medo, one step at a time. If we approach Medo recklessly, his cannons will blast us out the sky before we even get close. So I'm going to need you to test you before you take you with me. We read the words use the updraft in this ravine to hone our aerial archery skills. The updrafts are so strong here that a person could just open up a cloth over their head and float up easily. Hmm. Now let's see what you're capable of. If you have to maneuver through the air and destroy five targets set up in this valley in three minutes, hmm. then go to show five targets with your arrows. <coughs> Rough on my throat that, but cool. the side and fell. <laughs> hmm. Should have got my hopes up. Come back when she's serious about taking down Vine. Right. Yep. Link was it. Why did you show me what she made up? Ready? Right. Let's go. Just got caught on the edge there. I didn't realize I only had Oh, they take the ass out of him. You birds are I'm bad luck. <laughs> You're skilled at you. It was a time stops every arrow you let fly. I gotta tell you, Link. When you first showed up, I thought someone was pulling a prank on me. But seeing you handle that bow, I can tell you the real deal. You must have a seat of battle or two. Hundreds of them. Hmm. I believe it. Link, I feel I've heard the name somewhere before. Well, if you really want to help me bring down Meadow, it's now or never. I'll get you into position so you can give the, its cannons all you got. Hmm. Inside the treasure chest is a bow I've modified. Take it and let me know when you're ready. The only thing is, all the bows I've got are kind of better. Okay, time to feast Divine Beast Van Mado. Normal lovers will put a dent in those cannons. You need to hit with bomb arrows. These are precious commodities. Don't expect me to do this again, but take these bomb arrows. Twenty of them. Also, it'll be cold up there. You want to prepare a warm meal or bring some warm clothes? I'm ready, because once you're there, you get a warp point, so I can always come back down and get a shit ton of arrows and piss off like a bloody bat. Anyway, all right, well, let me ask you something. Why are you doing this? Why risk your life to bring down my dough? Hmm. You can't just sit and watch innocent people be terrorized? Then how, imagine how I feel as a proud Rito warrior. That's fair enough. Right, get on.
been awake almost 20 hours. Get some sleep, man. Hmm. All right, it's showtime. Man, even I feel like going to freeze up here. There's Divine Beast Farmer Door. There's this barrier up again. Oh, pain. What's wrong, Link? Too scared to talk? Let's go over the plan. You see those cannons? I'll draw their fire. While I'm doing that, use your bomb arrows to destroy the cannons. Got it so far? You need to withdraw for just a bit. Just spread your cloth and float straight up in the updraft for a while. I'll take that as a sign we need to regroup. Don't bother aiming for anything covered by Mado's barrier. It's impenetrable. Whatever you do, don't get close enough to touch it. Hmm. And finally, I know I've said this a few times already, but don't forget your cold protection. I'm wearing the gear from your village. You can move whenever you're ready. All right, let's go blow those it's cannons. Which? Probably best using that one. Because oh, it's so good to be able to just glide without having to give a shit. It's awesome. I shot free at that. So it's basically two regardless. He just blasted past me there. It's targeting us. We did it. Yes. Well, I don't know who does his voice. His voice, I forget. <laughs> well done, Link. That thing is history. All right, let's get one of the guardians done. Shot in the ass. Bad news, Link. Looks like I got hit pretty good back there. I think I think I need to get back to the flight range. I just hope that I can make it back. You head down to Meadow. Good luck. It's all you. Well, oh, Lee's got the sneezes. That would be a lovely ASMR's uh, voice. That type of story and stuff.
He finishes all this and then realizes he's got a big bill because that's like a credit card just paying for everything contactless. Well now, I've seen that face before. <laughs> I had a feeling you would show up eventually, but making me wait a hundred years is a bit indulgent. <laughs> You're here to wrest control of Meadow away from Ganon, correct? If so, then the first thing you'll want to do is find yourself a map. Da -da -da -da. That guidance stone has the information for the layout of this divine beast. Can you make it there? Such a sassy bitch. Can I actually, yeah, that's something. Can I use an evil as here? No, I can't. Ah. Only the one. Actually, no, wait a minute. That's bullshit. Oh, they're freaking, why are you not grabbing that? please you know what I had I had like a bit of a time with like really bad allergies at the really beginning of this kind of this heat wave I've been having but then shortly after I'm feeling relatively all right and you get to the stone door where is the stone Snatch. Oh. Ooh, yeah, I do not have a lot of health at all. No, not too bad. I'll save that for the boss. Guardian Spear. Oh, shit. <laughs> She's got a bit warm there. Bit warm, lass. Maybe we should have brought more noms. There's, there's plenty in the tub, but. Oh, she's asleep. She's asleep. Hey, give me a map. I meant Lynx is noms. Yes, actually, that's true. There's not really going to be ma any major monsters uh, until like, later on, so. Should be right. Also, I will say, I fucking hate these maps. 3D maps. Metroid Prime had one, and that was. With your map of the divine beast. The terminals that will activate Meadow are marked by those glowing points. You'll need to activate all of the terminals to take back control. Think you're up to it. God, he's such a sassy bitch. Go. 
which would be easiest to start with. Great. Pop. Popple doodle doo. Summer at least. Um. Oh, wait a minute. I don't know if I get any others with that. here hmm. you bitch why is that stop there oh I get it I see I see the issue That's annoying, come on. There we go. There are four terminals remaining. Still a ways to go. I'm following. I have a bond, but I have no idea what you're doing right now. I am trying to figure out how to open this. Just a little. Oops. <laughs> Shit. 
This got rid of that. <laughs> a bit too danger close. Before the boss, I may stop up on some nom noms. There's that, these as well. I get to destroy the metal bird part, but let's. Yup. There are three terminals remaining. I've got to scan it, all the terminals on the map. So I've now got three more, these three orbs here. This is something down there. Off we go. Come on, pop you bitch. Give me shit. Give me better shit. Where's the eye for that one? Hmm. That part I get too, the whole moving, the fans that make doors move and stuff, I don't see any ramble reasons to it, but hey, I've already concluded that Zelda gets frustrated me to the course of time. You've got to angle things so it moves some platforms and that around. Exactly the same thing again. I shot you, you bitch. Oh, actually, yeah, there's a doorway as well. Pop. Oh, that's gone. Up there. This music's very Shadow Colossus. It has a similar melody to it. <laughs> I think my skills are the part of the mathematical education are a bit lacking. There are two terminals remaining. You're almost there. Sounds so surprise you sack of shit. Absolutely battering through it. Saka's a much muster asshole. He is. He is a fair bit of a dick. Absolute bell cheddar is the man. Uh, 
Didn't want to do that. Stop going so high or too low. <laughs> For fuck's sake. Oh, actually. I'll do. Yes. So inside these guardians, the master sword is always charged. That's why I went for it first. Can plow through everything without worrying about breaking any of your weapons or all like that. through this just one terminal remaining <laughs> what now? I know that I'm better than you bird boy so you can chew on my glorious nudges this work Did. Let's so have a look at what is about. Ladies. <laughs> you sound almost surprised. Maybe a bit nicer. What's the point of it being nicer? We're fucking dead. Put you here. Don't want to bother with that. Battered through it. Ain't gonna lie, I kind of rock. <laughs> it says, but the amount of times he's just had his ass handed to him. Now you just need to start the main control unit. I want you to take a good look at your map. There should be a new glowing point on there. Well, flap to it. <laughs> Makes sense for him to say flap to it, but still. 
kind of cringe bra, as the kids would say. They don't say that. <laughs> as baby bubble would say, I am cringe. <laughs> Extra healers for this would have been nice, but if I remember right, I can throw a laser this master sword throws like a beam at them and it's glowing. It should make this fight a lot easier. I hate this as well, but they were all bases. That thing is one of Ganon's own, and it plays dirty. Only defeated me 100 years ago, but only because I was winging it. I can't believe I'm actually saying this. You must avenge me, Link. His aim is dead on. Watch yourself. Oh my god, that's taking so much of his health off. That was kicking his ass. Master Sword first was the best plan. Absolutely wiping the floor with him. Oh shit, I remember these. Watch your blind spot. Where is it? Shit. Oh shit. What? Why is that working? Is it because they're not full health? That's a possibility. <laughs> Absolutely wipe the floor with him. Piece of piss went down like an absolute chump. I think it was Thunder Blight Gana, which was hard, it's so. Because it was, I remember it being super fast. Full heart. I might get rid of a couple of hearts and swap them to stamina. Stamina is definitely needed. Oh, God. Cool.
absolutely spanked it. Right, come on, you smammy twat. <laughs> I'll be plugged. You defeated him, eh? What a shock. Well done. I suppose I should thank you now that my spirit is free. This returns Meadow back to its rightful owner. <laughs> Don't preen yourself just for doing your job. I do suppose you've proven your value as a warrior. A warrior worthy of my unique ability. The sacred skill that I have dubbed Ravali's Gale. Super useful. It's now time to move on and start making preparations for Meadow Strike on Ganon. But only if you think you'll still need my help while you're fighting inside Hyrule Castle. Feel free to thank me now. Quiet your bitch mouth. Or never mind, just go. Your job is far from finished, you know. Princess has been waiting an awfully long time. Yes, she is. Let's go find some more memories. Now I've got Rivalis Gale, and it seems a bit too. Mm, I should really end the stream. I've got an early morning, but I want to get more memories. There's no way that little scabby bit of rock would hold that. Absolutely not. And it's not like it's supporting its own weight with the fan still on. It's kind of rad. Meadow sights are now set. <laughs> You'll have a precise feed on Ganon from this vantage point. Time is right. Give him everything you've got. Now we wait for that perfect moment. <laughs> Meadow, you've been artfully patient for the last 100 years. I doubt you'll suffer a feather over a few more moments. <sighs> After all these years, I simply must admit the truth. Even without the power of flight, Link made his way to this divine beast and accomplished something that even I could not. Finally! I guess I was wrong about how lucky I might be. <laughs> Twat! Still a dick! Luck holds out, Link, for everyone's sake. What a jumped up gobshite he is. Ravala's girl. The blusterous power. Yeah, he has got a full of bluster. The prick. Uh, look at the. Actually, that's. Is that behind? Uh, hold on there. Yes, we do. Possibly round here. 
maybe try here uh, head further down if yeah because a lot of grassland there if I remember right that's over the other it's just that bridge that bridge is where I need it the steed takes the lead of being hunted will follow pathways without being told to do so oh it's because he's wild and he's a dick that finds a pin in the ass does not help that it's a bleeding storm. Where is the castle? So the thunder storms are cool than this. Right. So that's kind of cool. Them little circles, the little pulsating things they do. Kind of rad. see it not oh yes please <laughs> that was incredible <laughs> oh really love that that was <laughs> So there's a sort of spark of it. Yes. <laughs> Wait a minute. Uh, yes. I believe that might be it. That's exactly where I need to be. Oh, fucking hell. It's so shit scary, this <laughs> fucking... Yeah, this looks like the tree. Um, da 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 da! Could that lightning strike? Lit that up. It's like trying to remember where they are. But another one. There's one. Oh, and another. The flowers we have in Hyrule aren't just beautiful. They're also quite good stores ingredients for a variety of things. Here is called the Silent Princess. Yeah, you don't shut the fuck up. Endangered species. Despite our efforts, we can't get them to grow domestically yet. Got link there going. Only thrive out here. Copper look. All that we can hope is that the species will be strong enough to prosper on its own. <gasps> is that what I thought? Look at this. I don't believe it, but I actually caught one. This delicacy is no doubt Damn, very nice. perfect under the proper circumstances. Ta-da! Research from the castle shows ingesting one of these can actually augment certain abilities. We wouldn't be in a controlled environment out here if not for your level of physical fitness. You'd be a perfect candidate for the study. Go on. Taste them. Link could be there going. Like fucking Grogu just pulls it down in seconds. Like, yeah, I'm having that. <laughs> While we're here, we probably could batter the one out, um, which is oh, that's glowing again. That's cool. Fuck off. Um. Over 
here. Oh, fuck it. Sorry, I was away. Because I smelt my hand and did a lot of ouchy and bed stuff. Was... Wait, what? What have you done to yourself? Have you properly injured yourself? Right, let me think here. This pillar might be the best. Can I climb up these? I fucking hope so. God, really? We'll get to the top of it. I'm definitely not getting to the top of it. I've just used all my fucking things. I've x and used steroid cream on that. Makes my skin very thin. I smack my hand, rub very thin skin. So yeah, actually, oh, fucking hell. It's up there is where I need to be. So we're in Hyrule Castle. <laughs> it annoys me. It really shouldn't... They shouldn't have put a memory here, I don't think. Because it's making it out. This is the final battle. This is the final dungeon. I'm just going to fucking leave in a minute. Yeah, there's a... I'm pretty certain that where that twap sack is there is a... memory. And annoyingly, this jumped up tit has just used all these Rivali scales, which would have made that a shit ton easier. And the map is awful. I'm sorry, but it's like, how the fuck are you supposed to make sense of that? There's a lot of decayed turrets in here somewhere, but actually, because this is actually powerful here. Rid of that shit man as well would be a good idea. So I don't have him taking little pop shots at me. Sim bitch! to bandage the other hand it works put on better fitting bandages on other, uh, on other peeps are. a 
aside from injections. I don't get cut all that bad. Relatively sturdy, I'd like to think. <laughs> Up there, I need to go, but getting up there is the tricky thing. He says Rivali Gale's just as fucking worked up again, hasn't it? Sweet. Stupid idea. So it. Yeah, not a lot of health though. Um, doing a lot of meat. We should have a cooking pot nearby. That solved the entire problem. <laughs> uh, using one hand to bandage the other hand, it works. For, oh, no, sorry. Uh, no, it was just I bumped the back of my hand because the skin is so thin. It just rips open when it bumps. Fucking hell. I think it was old Pete's hands as a bruise easily, and the older they get, this is the same thing. Mine just trips open. Normally, I don't do the bleeding very much either. Fucking hell. <gasps> Fucking hell. Bloody adore that dress. It's so good. <laughs> now where we can actually be controlled right at the current rate the sea know all we need to know about the guardians and the divine beast and should gamma never show itself again we'll be well positioned to defend ourselves what are you doing out here zelda oh old king ball bag crotch short <laughs> link i bow i bow to the crotch the results of the experiments with the guardians these pieces of ancient technology could be quite useful against i know that they are essential to hyrule's future and our research demands that we keep a close eye on them however as the princess you currently have a crucial unfulfilled responsibility to your kingdom let me ask you once more when will you stop treating this as some sort of childish game I'm doing everything I can. I'll have you know that I just recently returned from a storm of courage where I offered every ounce of my prayers to the goddess. And now you are here wasting your time. You need to be dedicating every moment you have to your training. You must be single-minded in unlocking the power that will seal Calamity Ganon away. I already am. I'm 
should see there's nothing more I can do. My help. My help is the tube. Don't be a tit. You allow me to get with you here in whatever way I can. No more excuses, Zelda. Stop running away from your duty. As the king, I forbid you to have anything to do with these machines from this moment on. I command you to focus on your training. Do you know how the gossip bongos refer to you? They are out there at this moment, whispering amongst themselves. That you are the heir to a throne of nothing. Nothing but failure. Jesus. I didn't really, I forgot that he was such a dick about it. It is woven into your destiny that you prove them wrong. Do you understand? Yes. I understand. Knob. Such an absolute knob. This is Zelda's diary. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> Today I met Impa of the Sheikah tribe and began my research into the ancient technology in earnest. Impa introduced me to Pura and Robbie, other respected members of her tribe. Tomorrow I embark on an excavation with them. I hope to find ancient tech which to operate the guidance stones. Today we uncovered some ancient technology that we believe may have power to control the guidance stones. This is a rectangular object, small enough to be held in my two hands. Sheikah text is featured prominently on it. But it's made of an unknown material. But we believe it to be the same as the shrine scattered all across the region. Yapura is the little kid uh, in the Atea tech lab. And Rob is in another one where, where I did that last tower. He's there near there. It proposed that I hold on to it for now. I hope it leads some new developments in our research. The stone relic we discovered has been named. We're calling it the Sheikah Slate. We have not found any mention of a name the forest object in the records we've unearthed so far. Nevertheless, Pura insists we call it the Sheikah Slate, as a relic is a slate made by the Sheikah tribe. It feels a bit on the nose to me, but it was not a fight I could win. We did it! We were actually able to restore some functionality to the Sheikah Slate. We have discovered that the stone slate is uh, capable of producing images, perfect likeness of the things you pointed at. Unlike normal pictures drawn by hand, it requires no artist to capture anything in perfect detail. I deeply admire the accomplishments of the Sheikah technology. Still, I know there is more to learn. There must be. We believe that the Sheikah Slate may have functioned that will allow it to control the guidance stone. We must continue our research and quickly. I've started training the champions who will pilot the divine beasts. <laughs> it's a mobile phone room. Yeah, it's just, it's just a fucking iPad love. It may sound rude. I found this unexpected, but Mifa mastered the controls with surprising ease. Daruk struggled at first, but eventually got the hang of it. Abursa and Rivali both managed just fine as well. I can finally see the light of hope in our fight against a rising calamity. Robbie has restored mobility to many of the guardians we've excavated, but we still yet to find all the guardians. Record mentioned a greater number of them, and even more types. They're said to be restored in the five giant columns that rest beneath Hyrule Castle. The thing is, no matter how I search beneath the castle, I can't seem to locate these columns. They must be buried deep. So those are the Oh, so he took control of those. Those are actually the towers controlling all the guardians. Oh, that makes so much sense now. But it had perhaps designed to sense the appearance of Calamity Cannon and to only activate upon its return. Countless ancient structures have been discovered across Hyrule, but all attempts to enter them have failed. Records indicate that these facilities decided to train the hero who is fated to combat the Calamity. But the crucial activation mechanism remains a mystery. Is the Sheikah Slate the key to activating them? That is purest theory, and I concur, and yet my experiments so far have been fruitless. Still, we must exhaustively investigate all means of opposing the Calamity, 
we must not give up, no matter what. Am I getting Zelda's voice pretty much spot on it? It's, it sounds in my head decent, but it's probably not. Um, it has text and text photos, you can use it to download maps, so you can use it as a GPS. Seems a mobile phone. Also makes bombs. Um, I spoke with Pura about the sh Shrine of Resurrection we discovered earlier. As we speculated, this particular shrine is in fact a medical facility with the power to heal. It also has a long-term stasis function, which can be activated and maintained until healing is complete. In a war against a calamity 10,000 years ago, were the injuries so great as to necessitate such a facility? If so, I will require un I remain uneasy until we have made all the adjustments necessary to restore it to its full work in order. I can only pray that even if calamity can returns, our battle will not require the Shrine of Resurrection's power. Well, I thought it was more, to be honest. Well, this is her study. Right, uh, leave area. I'm going to you today. Can find a way to do that too. Oh no, if it were them, uh, was it Samsung Galaxy ones, the newer ones, they were blowing up. <laughs> Fighting your cage. You will not get through the bars. You are a prisoner for the rest of your days. Sorry. Had to get a bit of tough love there. So how many left? There's only two left. Uh, no, wait a minute. This There's lots of bridges here, but it's like a proper bridge. So I'm trying to figure Ooh. that seems promising. I remember it being here, there's a lot of lizards around there as well. We could also be fucking up here. No, it's a, it's a brick bridge, so it's not. Go here. Can you stop it by the cage? Keep dreaming you in here. Oh my god, getting up here is gonna be way easier. I'm certain of it. Look them up. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna look it up because I wanna. There's only a couple of things for it, so let me have a scan here. So it's near somewhere called Lanerius Bluff. So it's round here. So what? Oh god, I've got a shrine. No, 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 that's where I am now. Oh my god, I got fuck all near it. <laughs> Shit. Me Kakariko. I might get the rest of the Sheikah stuff as well, actually, while I'm here. Sell me gems. I also never found the fucking chicken. <gasps> it's there! 
Yes. Where is he? Bitch. I've got all your crap. Is it kind of? Recently, the Yuka clan has been acted suspiciously, so I choose to protect Lady Imbo. But, more importantly, I think I can hear the wing sounds of Cuckoo slapping in little wings. Could it be? Yep, found him. I knew it. That faint yet lovely flapping of wings, that musical clocking. Ah, oh, truly the epitome of joy. I'm so eager to get back home. Lord Link, I'm so happy that everyone's safe. Thank you so much. I'm afraid this isn't much, but please take it with my thanks. I'm ready to get out there again, though I do wish my wife could come back to me, just like my cuckoos did. <laughs> it's fucking tragic, isn't it, to be fair? I said, you just wait until you're asleep, you will never know. <laughs> no, she's she's back at it, destroying the cage. Right, let's... Let me sell shit. I wanna sell. I'm not bothering with all of them. I'm gonna keep all the lunar stones. Actually, no. No, they want to sell it each. Why did, why did I put that to free and then press all of them? So I'm a fucking idiot, that's why. Oh. I want to sell. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm not paying attention. Cool. If we get this as well. Hey. Actually, if I sell. Oh, we've got all the rubbish. Let me just check here. Actually, works out cheaper just to sell all the Lunar Stones as is. Without. Five hundred rupees for a diamond, but seven hundred rupees for ten lunar stones. So why the fuck do you, there's a Zora where you give lunar stones and it gives you a diamond and you give them ten? Sorry, but this shop that it sounds uh, really suggestive when you buy or sell stuff. Oh yeah, he says that she's doing that because she's a hamster. They don't do anything <laughs> annoying on everything they see. I say the difference between. I'm glad that they're both though. Quite, you know, they're not nasty or anything, but I've never seen to put two polarizing hamsters than Munchie and Aurelia. They look completely different. Although, saying that, when Munchie had a plastic cage, and it was a habit trail one, it did chew through certain bits, which made the hamster wheel fall off. And then he um, escapes. Where oh, Bloopy gone? Get him. They don't even notice you coming anywhere near them. Which is really nice. Very helpful. Getting shits on the fairies. Right. 
Like so. I have to go all the way down here. They had the tickets here in the last game. Jesus. Did we have a titty lady in this last game? We did in Twilight Princess. Right, what are the bets? Take your bets. Is this the Yiga clan? I bet it is. Hmm. About a year ago, I was walking on the road with you that night. And suddenly I saw a blind light in the sky. When my eyes finally adjusted, I found myself looking at a shimmering object floating overhead. Couldn't look away. Next thing I knew, I was bathed in light. When I came to, I woke up in bed covered in sweat. What? What do you think about that? It felt like a dream. At first I thought it was a bad dream, but then the bed I woke up in wasn't my bed. It was a bed full of liquid in an empty room. When I looked in the corner, there was a weird glowing device. When I touched the device, I was overwhelmed with a feeling of familiarity. When I came to, I was here. Mm? What do you think about that? Uh, that's some... Um, does this story sound familiar? Hillian Champion? Yeah. Mm. Your story ends here, hero boy. They are so useless. <laughs> Just shit. My Jimmy could open his walk his walking ball and hop out. He was walking through my room and went to the kitchen and cut my dinner. Do I look at the door of the kitchen? He was sitting there at me, Jimmy buddy. He was just supposed to be in the ball and not near the kitchen. It's the things that just so they can be they can be pretty weak. Worse was when Munchie well yeah, when Munchie got out of the cage. He um He, oh, he got in the side of the beanbag and I had to split the beanbag up and to get to him and fuck me that was a ball ache right so it's at the other end of there let me have a look at the map because I know there's a load of enemies in between I just cannot be arse with them so yeah it was underwhelming to say <laughs> The, we haven't seen any of the big Giga boys though. I don't get why we've not seen any of them. Hmm. Yeah, Fred was a funny until they're not. It was funny though, because he, he kept jumping back into the all the beans. I've got a video of him doing it, it really cute. So this was here, and then one more, get all the memories, and then I'll call it a night there. Oh, wait a minute. Did we get the cool ass? Oh, there's a shrine somewhere as well. She thinks behind that waterfall. the fuck did they see me? Simple enough. So it's at the top of this road. They still have fun themselves. You as a person who has to try and get them out of trouble, however, I'm not here. Yeah. 
he did an attendant suit. Once he, if he did ever get out, was go downstairs and hide in a little corner, corner of the living room. And you, you just find him there. It's like, why, why do you do it? <laughs> Uh, can't believe it. I'm not sure if I remember this video. Oh. <laughs> wow, they've been out fucking. in suspense how'd everything go up there on the mountain so you didn't feel anything no power at all Someone... then let's move on you've done all you could feeling sorry for yourself won't be of any help after all, it's not like your last shot was up there on Mount Minoru. Anything could finally spark the power to seal Ganon away. We just have to keep looking for that thing. A burst is amazing. <laughs> That's kind of you, isn't it? If I may, I think you need to know. I'm not sure how to put this into words. I'm actually quite embarrassed to say it. But I was thinking about what I do when I'm healing. You know, that usually goes through my mind. It helps when I think, when I think about. That looks badass though. This is it then. Are you sure? Positive. It's a way. The only way. Let's stop wasting time. We're gonna need everything we got to take that thing down. Now, champion, to your divine beast. Show so that swirling swine who's boss. Think we'll need to meet Ganon head on when we attack. This needs to be a unified assault. Little guy, you get the Hyrule Castle. You can count on us for support, but it's up to you to pound Ganon into oblivion. Come, we should go. We need to get you someplace safe. No. I'm not a child anymore. I may not be much use on the battlefield, but there must. There must be something I can do to help. Yeah, it was quite a small little corner that he got in. So, but he said that swirling beast is when. How do you know it's a swirling beast? Rivali was the only one who got to see it. But Daruk is there going, yeah, I fucking know. Right. So the last one this week. Is apparently in a swamp. Oh. Um. Uh, just quickly looked it up, but I've already lost where it might have been. <laughs> Which is very typical for myself. Oh, it's here. Over there somewhere. So it's there. There we go. All the memories. Oh, do we go see Imper after? They saw some stuff from behind the mountain. Maybe he just made you look, I guess. I'm still trying to make sense of games, especially Nintendo's. Yeah, sometimes. 
quality wise they're really good especially like for bugs and that they have very little of them you know some people have found them but it's taken a lot to get to there I like Sega games where it's just built from bugs <laughs> Um, it's the green one I'm after. Ooh. Hello. Right. Oh, ah, there. Yeah, but yeah, every now and again. All these bits they go, that makes no fucking sense. It's like those things that don't make sense would have made it very hard to do the Super Mario film. And it doesn't really make massive amounts of sense, but it's just really, really fun. I kind of like how they acknowledged as well M Mario not having the really over the top accent. Horses. Are we here? Oh, that makes actually a lot of fucking sense. Evening, Jones. Absolutely spanked. Yeah, it's fun, but sometimes I just like a really good story. Don't need to be there with Nintendo games to be fair. Yeah, exactly. Oh, I kind of want that though. Eat shit and then everything else I have. Oh, was that just a. No, no. Oh, for fuck's sake. Stop picking up shit. I'm sorry, but I just love the axe. It looks so fucking good. And it'll help me with the one side quest I want to do, which is the Helium Homeowner one. I said it was around here. Well, actually, further down there. Hey, what? Yeah. Oh, somewhere here. Oh, where all them swords are. That makes sense. The graveyard of swords here. Nope, not there either. Where the fuck is this memory? Where have you got this? It's in a wood. So, hold on. Am I looking at the completely wrong? Now, nah, shit. It's the only one I'm missing. It's 
Scrolling down, trying to find this shit. Oh, no, it's not. Oh, right, no, that might be bottomless swamp. Through Scouts Hill. Uh, what is this? Oh, yeah, bottom of swamp. Bottom of swamp, and it's somewhere in here. Right? We'll get there in the end. <laughs> Figure of noms for Link. Link. Um, no, he's hardly got any noms. But I'm only trying to get these two um, memories. It's just trying to find the spot. I'm sure there was one there though. He said on the map. Oh no, that. Yeah, I'll go speak to Impa and she'll give me a new one. It, it will all make sense in the end. This doesn't seem like I'm heading in the right direction. Oh, that's because I'm fucking miles away from it. Because I'm an idiot. Sorry. Oops. 2 a.m. Still temp high, but I'm going to try to do some sleeping builders over here uh, in five hours again. Oops. Fucking hell. That sucks. But yeah, get some kip. Go get these memories. Call it a night. Because I'm up way too late already. Bitches, <laughs> get fucked. Actually, with it being darker, it should light up really well. Da -da -da -da. I should be in love. I could do is chopping some trees down because I need a load of wood for the home building one. trailers how did we come to this the fine beasts the guardians they've all turned against us it was calamity ganon well he no turned shit. them all against us everyone from the brook nervosa navoni and daruk Hope for defeating Ganon was lost, all because I couldn't harness the cursed power. Everything, everything I've done up until now, 
this all for nothing. No, I really am just a failure. All my friends, the entire kingdom, my father, my friends, have tried and have failed. Good scene, that one. A really good bit to it. Philip <laughs> Coppers in the back going, Hi! <laughs> it's all to our pictures. Sit, bitches. trees really well. Yes, absolutely does. from that. I think I need 30 bundles of wood. Oh my god. 24? Not far off. God damn this axe is good. Imper, who is uh, Kakariko village, Kakariko village. Travel back. We've just go. Hey, look what I found. I should go go back here. Blah blah blah. memory is Zelda actually unlocking the ceiling power I believe I'm trying to remember but so love So the sword has been returned to its rightful owner, eh? Just like expected of your hero. The sword that sealed the darkness is your counterpart. So as long as that blade is at your side, you shall wield enormous power. The princess resists me for you for that sword. Do not forget that, and do not waste this chance. Ah, oh, that's right. Oh, uh, see. So you've gained the power of Rivali. Thank you for freeing one of the divine beasts from climate and his control. But they're over still. I know. If all his power is that of wind, it'll prove to be most useful. Still, the bad beast for Anaboris remains. That's one controlled by Uboso the Gerudo. But I've wrote it also remains that one controlled by Mifa the Zora. And Rudania also remains that the one controlled by Duruka the Gorons. Alright. What? 
Now you just know me. I knew all this already. <laughs> you are Princess Zelda's only hope, and I rules as well. You got to turn back now. Follow your heart and seize your destiny. Ah. By the way, how are you faring thus far? No, oh, all 12 pictures already. You've visited every place. And I suppose it's time I'll reveal the location of the final memory. Here's what happened. Oop. Lady Zelda gave me specific instructions. She asked me to wait to show you this. This is the final picture. Does it look familiar? From this village, you should be able to get there in half a day's time. Now go, child. Seek out what Lady Zelda has shown you. Right, let's go sort that out. Salted. I wonder if the champions will make any further appearance in the sequel. With like Rivali, Abosa and all that. Aruka Mifa. I save some time, but not really. I'm definitely going to swap some of my hearts for stamina. Maybe get rid of four and make another stamina room. Is it four for a stamina room? Now oh, piss off. Just keep ch chase me. Here somewhere. Somewhere around here. No one here that it's supposed to be. There it is. Look at Lee's tail. It's weird that when they sleep it just goes long. Don't curl up like you usually see a pug's tail. It's like the first time I've ever really seen him absolutely haggard.
that lullaby sounds like awesome in there. No. Link, get up. <coughs> We're just fine. <laughs> like it looks at like going, Don't bullshit me, bitch. <laughs> Sam gives me fucking PTSD. Link, you can still be safe. Princess! Fucking uh, Princess. Hidden leaf are here. Right. Take Link to the Shrine of Resurrection. If you don't get in there immediately, we are going to lose him forever. Is that clear? So make haste and go. His life is now in your hands. Link. 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 Yes, I'm here. You have recovered all of your memories of that from 100 years ago. I am here. Inside Hyrule Castle. It is now time for you to defeat Ganon. <laughs> yes. Right. Uh, just going to go back to Kakariko, though. And speak to Impra again and see what she says about the fact I've done the last memory. And then call it a night. It seems you've visited all locations. A hundred years ago, you and Princess were quite close. You were a comfort and encouraging presence to her, but she struggled each day to fulfill her destiny. That is why she believes in you, and why she has the strength to fight Ganon all alone. Link, the princess. Please hurry and save our princess. She's been fighting all alone for a hundred years. Right, cool beans. Hey, Pyre. <laughs> no, please don't fight me like that. She needs something from me, PSO. What you doing? <laughs> Just trying to have some thoughts. Just my boring daily affairs and such. Really, that, that's all it is. Is that okay with you? The baby. It's almost done. If you haven't slept yet, you really should. Stay up late. Can't be great for your health. Well, you know, sleep there. Um, so, let's save. So, see if there's anyone that we know of. Um, I just keep playing things I don't want to be seeing. Stop it. Uh, right, so on that, I'm probably going to give it a miss, but I will. So. I don't know why that hair looked really weird for a second. Um, so, I'm unlikely to be streaming tomorrow. If I do, it'll be later. <laughs> If I do, I may be mildly inebriated. 
my other one's probably not going to be the case. It's probably going to be more of that. Be modest inebriation. Um, it's because I'm having a drink with my brother and my dad for Father's Day because my dad's always away. <laughs> He's coming back over, uh, back to his actual house, which is gathering dust uh, tomorrow morning. So I'll be doing that. So uh, Tuesday, I'm going to do some more. Might blast through a couple of guardians because it took us no time to batter through that. So should be easy enough. So with that, I'm going to call it a night there. And hopefully, I will see you again, possibly tomorrow, but it's unlikely, Tuesday. So, hopefully, I will see you then. And, and then a bit of a Sons of the Forest, hopefully on Wednesday. So, until then, see you then.